is the the start was MJ Emerson on Justin Jefferson got a PBU Cam Mitchell great coverage PBU and then we had uh, the third one they threw an income so they started Sam Darnold's over three and one ones on the other side Amari big play big play to uh, Elijah Moore as well Aikens just had a nice one and you know they did get Jordan Addison went and made a big play got past Khalif Velassi but for the most part in a one-on-one -on -one situation they're certainly holding their own uh, are the Cleveland Browns Landers working on the at the top. A nice little comeback nice route there. there. Such good size. That's just he does have good. So look good at that. Cam Mitchell running that route, and right. that is a he pick. Cam Mitchell ran that route working against Thayer Thomas out of NC State and takes it to the house. I understand, and, and if you're just joining us, J.J. McCarthy out for the year. Yeah. Kevin O'Connell announcing. Hey, maybe you want to take a look at the Browns quarterback room this week. Well, yeah, I have a feeling. Giving what's going on here. Tyler Huntley is going to be on full display for them this yeah, week here. Feels like it, yeah. Uh, depending on what their objective is. You know, it's one of those teams where the objective is interesting. Like, is this a, hey, we're, we're trying to build something, but we could turn, certainly take an off-road to tank? Uh, that, that might be in play, too. You have to understand from an organizational standpoint. I mean, what this goodness is pretty bad. gracious. Yeah, the lack of accuracy of the quarterback. So, <laughs> I'm this sure this. we don't want to speed this up. This pretty is wild. awful. There's Amari. There's a big one deep down. Oh, field. had a step. Yeah, Deshaun put that one more inside. He probably had him out. He did hit uh, Chief on a big one yep. uh, over there as well in the last couple of minutes. So you're getting uh, some, some good stuff here. And there's a DTR. Now back in a pick from uh, Minnesota on that side of things. Good coverage there by Edmonds, the, the young undrafted free agent out of Arizona State. Right, I don't think they've completed a pass to their tight ends. On the other side, I've seen our tight ends catch a lot of passes. Another one right there. It's a team that's waiting for TJ Hawkinson to come back, obviously. You know, they're not, that's not the same mm. tight end room that they had certainly last year when he was in the mix for them. Uh, you're going to get uh, Jefferson here with Emerson on the, the near field right in front yeah. of us. So this is your uh, See, I'm sure strength he's gonna strength. Lobbying for the officials and for a little bit of handsy. Yeah. Delayed release on the outside, oh. sells the vertical, hitches it up. Good coverage. Good route, good coverage. Yeah. Good he's, route, good coverage, completion. something else yeah. route runner. Isn't really it? scary when he opened the Ari Thrash, easy, taking candy from a baby, working against – that was against Byron Murphy, who was a former first or second round pick out of Washington. Yeah, yeah. The cool Browns to see have Delpit some work with these against these receivers. Oh yeah, he's really challenging himself daily. There's the first one to a tight end over Brady Breeze. He got that one in there to Trey Knox, the rookie out of South Carolina. You can watch it right now, YouTube.com/slash yeah. Browns. Yeah, we, I, I gave you a heads up on this. There man. you go. You're, yeah. you're able to. All right, do here's Velasi and Addison. Addison beat him vertically the first time. I mean, there's got to be eight flags. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> a little hands. <laughs> Khalif guy, you got. Listen, he got called for a flag as well yeah. in the game, so you got to watch it. Jerry Judy, by the way, over there. Every time I look up he's just running away from somebody with the football he's working against the Caleb Evans there number two corner number 21 you have to remember that Jerry Judy was in college with Justin Jefferson was his and blitz as a route, winner. right and as a route, Landers wow he got him deep oh gotta get the ball Jameis doing a push-up after that one yeah had him that was the one-on-one -on -one for push-ups yeah. And however, Jameis had However, him. they shouldn't be. Well, there's a Officials flag. Officials threw two flags and said, pass interference pass oh. defense. Oh, oh, and now oh. they switch. Up are the Browns and down yeah, are the down Vikings. Down are the Vikes on that. How one. about it? Push-ups at the end. Landers. Of the boy, Landers. Yeah, he got good separation on that. Listen, like I said, it, it, I, we, I, it was an underthrown ball. Yeah. But if he threw it, an accurate ball, it was a walk-in touchdown. It was, yeah. So I would say they feel like they were bailed out, that they still get to play goal line defense, and we would say we were bailed out because it could have been an incompletion. Absolutely. It's a win-win. It's a sign of a good compromise. No one's happy. That's right. Uh, so the team's uh, getting a quick water break here. In the meantime, let me tell you, Browns fans, Eric Cleveland Browns hitting quicker on game day with Express Access presented by Verizon. Also new this year, select concession stands will offer Express Access presented by Bud Light. Enroll for free today. Go to the Tickets tab in the Browns mobile app to learn more. It's just all about making it easier for you when, enjoy, when you enjoy your games. 
uh, down on the lake on a given Sunday, Monday, or Thursday, as it were. Um, all right, so uh, we, we had some one-on-one -on -one stuff on the outside that has taken place, and what are we going to get here now? Looks like let's special go to, teams. Let's go to special teams. GBA, the scheduler. Uh, I don't have this on my schedule. Okay, you're right, I, I've got a couple focal points, but it, yeah. I see I see Brable running, and that's, I feel that, like that's usually a special team. They're probably going to get some kickoff work, would be my guess here. And that's what it looks like. Yeah, Browns are set up for a kick return, the dynamic kickoff. The question is, are the powers that be going to say that'll be enough of the video stream back to you guys? Let's hope they just no, I don't think that's going to happen. Well, let's see. We'll see. Right now, you're still enjoying it. Um, you enjoyed all those one-on-ones. If you're uh, watching on the YouTube stream.